ओके हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम एंड वेलकम बैक टू आर चैनल सो आज वी हैव डिस्कस्ड इन द लास्ट वीडियो दैट वी आर गोइंग टू सॉल्व द टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चन व्हिच आर मोर एक्सपेक्टेड फ्रॉम द स्मॉल ऑसिलेशंस वी विल गेट इन द सी एस आर नेट सो द फर्स्ट पार्ट ऑलरेडी वी हैव डिस्कस दैट द टाइप वन पार्ट इन विच वील गेट लाइक the potential is given and we have to find out the frequencies or we have to find out the time period and all now from this uh, uh, this uh, second type uh, we'll we will discuss the type 2 from this small oscillation part that is we have to find out the normal mode frequencies okay so in this type of particular type of question we will uh, the question in the question you will uh, find the uh, lagrangian is given you are and from that lagrangian you have to uh, separate t and v or if the lagrangian is not given you have to find t and v if lagrangian is given that is well and good if lagrangian is not given and only potential is given or only only the kinetic energy part is given you have to find out the t and v of the system and after that you have to put this in the secular equation this secular equation is nothing but the eigen value equation and by solving this eigen value equation we will find the eigen values and these eigen values are nothing but our normal mode frequencies so this is the case so just you have to find the Lang lagrangian and after that lagrangian you have to separate the t and v and you have to uh, in the matrix format these must be in the matrix format okay so uh, uh, the main thing is from this lagrangian you have to write this in the matrix format okay so uh, you have to write t and v in the matrix format and this secular equation is also in matrix format so we have to find the determinant uh, and uh, you have to equate the determinant to zero and from there we will get the eigen values and those eigen values are nothing but the normal mode frequencies so you will get definitely this is an important question and uh, you will get this question in uh, also a gate a gate and net and also you will get j in jest so this is the important question which you will encounter in the any entrance examination from the classical mechanics small oscillation part okay so we'll jump to the question now directly so i will just uh, because uh, already from uh, in the first video we just know that when we are considering the small oscillator oscillation part that is uh, the system makes oscillation about the mean position and at the mean position we are uh, we, that is our stable point and uh, at that stable point we will we, we will see like uh, for equilibrium con condition you have to equate dou v by dou x or equal to 0 and uh, from there we will find out uh, the x point x not point and that uh, all about that we have already discussed now this is the second part okay so uh, from uh, how to find out the uh, mode frequency from the given lagrangian of a system okay this question was there in csr net so uh, you will get this type of question okay so basically we know uh, like uh, how is the method that we know uh, the lagrangian is always in terms of the generalized velocities right lagrangian is we know that is a function of generalized uh, momentum generalized generalized velocity generalized coordinate and time okay so uh, this is like lagrangian we know that is a um, uh, that is always in terms of like q1 dot square let i let i am describe like this q2 dot square okay so uh, and let uh, and the the potential is half uh, k um, x uh, sorry q1 square plus q2 square my, uh, minus 2 or minus 2 q1 q2 something like that okay so this is the Uh, lagrangian so uh, see this is my kinetic energy part which is t and this is the b so i have to write this in form in terms of determinant 
you have to see this like observe this carefully okay so t i can write in determinant format like you have to write this like this okay this is like t and you have to write here q1 dot because this uh, kinetic energy is in terms of generalized velocity so q1 dot q2 dot here also you have to write q1 dot q2 dot c q1 dot q2 q1 dot into q1 dot that is q1 dot square so what is the uh, like um, coefficient of q1 dot square let half is common so i am taking half outside so q1 dot and q1 dot we are getting your aim and similarly uh, q1 dot q2 dot there is no term such as q1 and q1 dot q1 dot and q2 dot so we have to put here zero similarly q2 dot q1 dot terms are not there so zero and similarly when you are seeing q2 dot square that is q2 dot into q2 dot that is q2 dot square and the coefficient is m here so we got the t matrix that is the kinetic energy matrix part that is equal to m 0 0 m because half is common we are taking we are not considering that, that now okay so similarly for b c we have to write this as i as i as we uh, as we have written for the case of kinetic energy part okay so the, here also v i am writing here you have to write here q1 q2 here q2 q2 dot our potential is always in that is a function of q1 only that is uh, generalized coordinate only okay so q1 dot sorry q1 into q1 that is q1 square c what is the coefficient here i am taking a half outside so here this is uh, k here as a c you have to write this uh, whenever there is a term like minus 2 q1 dot q2 just such such as this you have to write here you have to divide this as minus q1 q2 minus q2 q1 because they both are same just we have to uh, like write like this so that we can uh, easily express this in terms of this determinant okay so now q1 q2 we got here minus k minus is here and uh, a k is there so and now also we don't have to consider this one okay so la, uh, now also see q2 q1 we have minus q2 q1 so minus k here and here we have k okay so now we have to write the secular equation that is the eigenvalue equation b omega square t determinant so uh, I, we can rise, uh, write easily okay if i write this as uh, b minus omega square t that becomes like uh, that becomes uh, m uh, sorry k minus m omega square minus k and here minus k k minus m omega square that equal to zero we have to solve this determinant okay so this is the process okay this is the process you have to follow in order to solve the uh, such type of uh, question okay so now we'll jump to the question which is there in the csr net so see this is half m q under see this is in terms of q under q dot sometimes uh, and uh, uh, also it may be in terms of x1 dot x2 dot x y so you have to uh, accordingly you have to form the determinant okay so see the langrasian is given we have to just compose the t and uh, okay i'm di ri directly writing the t and b matrices okay so for t matrices uh, matrix we are seeing uh, we have to take here half we are taking common and here q1 q2 q1 q2 sorry dot are there q1 dot q2 dot okay so now um, if i'll take half here common we are getting your aim okay and here no q1 and q2 are 0 here also 0 and there is 2m so this becomes uh, 4m okay this is the kinetic energy matrix okay now for b c here b i as i have uh, told you earlier you have to express this in terms of like q1 q2 and q2 q1 so i can write here q1 q2 minus q2 q1 okay so see 
uh, if i'll take uh, okay i'm just writing here the uh, potential energy part that is uh, k 5 by 4 q1 square plus 2 q2 square minus 2 q1 q2 so i have to express it this okay i have to now if uh, if i'll take half common that will be easy because in both in in the total circular equation i will get uh, half common so i can neglect or that and equate to zero okay so k uh, uh, if i'll just uh, taking half common here so if i'll take half here i will get here 5 by 2 q1 square plus okay okay if i'll take half here this is big sum this becomes 4 um, q2 square minus q1 q2 okay this becomes 4 q1 q2 Uh, if i'll take half so 4q and q2 i can write the write it minus 2q and q2 minus q2 minus 2q2 q1 okay because as i am taking half common here this will become minus q1 q2 minus q2 q1 okay so now i will write the matrix format so q1 q2 q1 q2 so here i will half is already we have taken common so this becomes q1 square so q1 square this becomes 5 by 2k this becomes uh, minus 2k this becomes also minus 2k and this becomes 4q2 square that is 4k now you have to solve this you have so what the circular equation here becomes the determinant It, this becomes b minus omega square t that becomes pi by 2k minus m this is a 2 cross 2 matrix this is also a 2 cross 2 matrix just pi by 2k minus m omega square this becomes minus 2k because minus 2k minus 0 here and here also minus 2k then the next term 4k minus 4m omega square okay we have just multiply omega square here now we have to solve this question okay so if uh, if uh, i will go for the solve for solving this okay so this becomes uh, uh, 5 by 2 m uh, sorry 5 by 2 k uh, minus m omega square this is minus 2k minus 2k and here 4k minus 4 a omega square okay okay so now uh, i have to equate to this to zero see so now when i solve this this is easy we have to just solve the determinant this becomes 4k minus 4 a omega square and here we got here 4k square equal to 0 now uh, see so i will multiply here i got here 5 is to 4 that is 20k and 20k square by 2 that will be 10k square minus uh, 4 minus 5 by 2k into minus 4m omega square this becomes uh, 2 to the cancel and we will get uh, will get here uh, 10m omega square k okay and the next term also we are getting 4k m omega square plus 16 m square omega power 4 minus 4k square equal to 0 okay okay so here we are getting uh, 6k square minus 14m omega square k uh, plus because this we have cancel out 16m square omega power 4 equal to 0 okay so now i hope you, you can this so if i will take two common this becomes 7m omega square k plus 8m square omega power 4 and let me check okay somewhere i must have made mistake here mm just a second 
just a second just a second okay 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 let me check the equation this is 4k one by two if i'm taking common this will be five by two uh four two q two square right okay okay sorry not this is not 16 because this is four and this is m omega square only this will be four only okay and this is also four here and this is we will take two this uh, this becomes two if we will take two common so here we got uh, 3k square i can express it as minus uh, 6m omega square k minus uh, m omega square k plus 2m square omega power 4 equal to 0 so if i will take a common 3k uh, this becomes k minus 2m omega square similarly if i will take uh, m omega square common here i minus this becomes k 2m omega square equal to 0 so by equating both 3k minus this becomes 3k minus m omega square uh, into k minus 2m omega square so that equal to 0 so i got the values omega square is equal to uh, 3k by m sorry 3k by m root over and here i get omega equal to uh, 2m omega square right so k by 2m root of so my answer will be the first one okay so i hope you guys uh, like can solve these type of questions okay so see okay okay then uh, i hope uh, you guys are well and good and uh, uh, if you will solve this type uh, basically you will get this type of question in the net and gate in so many uh, year you have the uh, in gate these type of questions are there okay so okay then we'll come with another question till then stay safe take care